Jennifer Garner files restraining order against Ben Affleck stops him from seeing the kids. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to stay updated with all our latest videos. Today, we have some shocking news that's been making headlines. Jennifer Garner has filed a restraining order against Ben Affleck to stop him from seeing her and the kids. Stick around as we delve into the details of this dramatic turn of events and what it could mean for the Garner Affleck family. You won't want to miss this. To understand the gravity of the situation, we need to take a look at the history between Jennifer Garner and Ben Affleck. The two Hollywood stars got married in 2005 and have three children together, Violet, Serafina, and Samuel. They were once considered one of Hollywood's golden couples, but their marriage hit the rocks, leading to their separation in 2015 and finalizing their divorce in 2018. Despite their split, they remained committed to co-parenting their children and often expressed mutual respect for each other in public. So, what led Jennifer Garner to take such a drastic step as filing a restraining order? According to sources close to the family, there have been escalating tensions over the past few months. Reports suggest that Garner has been increasingly concerned about Affleck's behavior and its impact on their children. While details are still emerging, it is believed that a recent incident was the final straw for Garner, prompting her to seek legal protection for herself and her kids. Ben Affleck has been open about his struggles with alcoholism and has undergone several stints in rehab. Garner has been supportive of Affleck throughout his journey to sobriety, even after their divorce. However, sources indicate that Garner felt Affleck's recent behavior posed a risk to their children's well-being leading her to take legal action. Filing a restraining order is not a decision taken lightly, especially when it involves preventing a parent from seeing their children. The legal process involves presenting evidence to the court that supports the need for protection. Garner's legal team reportedly provided compelling evidence that convinced the judge to grant the temporary restraining order. The restraining order stipulates that Affleck must stay a specified distance away from Garner and their children. Additionally, it outlines strict guidelines about communication and visitation, ensuring that any contact is supervised and in a controlled environment. The restraining order is bound to have a significant impact on the family dynamics. For the children, it means a sudden change in their routine and possibly a sense of instability. Garner is said to be doing everything in her power to maintain a sense of normalcy for her kids during this challenging time. She has reportedly sought counseling and support for them to help navigate this difficult period. The public reaction to this news has been mixed. While many people sympathize with Garner's decision to prioritize her children's safety, others are concerned about the impact on Affleck's mental health and sobriety. Social media is abuzz with opinions and the story has sparked a broader conversation about co-parenting addiction, and the challenges of navigating family life in the public eye. As the situation continues to unfold, both Garner and Affleck will face significant challenges. Garner will likely focus on protecting her children and ensuring their well-being, while Affleck will need to demonstrate his commitment to sobriety and stability if he hopes to regain unsupervised access to his kids. The court will review the restraining order in the coming weeks, and a more permanent decision will be made. This could involve ongoing supervised visits or other arrangements arrangements that balance the need for safety with Affleck's parental rights. This story is a sobering reminder of the complexities and challenges that come with co-parenting, especially in the context of personal struggles like addiction. Jennifer Garner's decision to file a restraining order against Ben Affleck highlights her dedication to her children's safety and well-being, even in the face of difficult circumstances. We'll continue to follow this story closely and keep you updated on any new developments. In the meantime, what are your thoughts on this situation? Do you think Garner made the right decision? Let us know in the comments below. Before you go, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more updates on this story and other celebrity news. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.